Halima Sadia radiallahu ta'ala anha is a blessed foster mother of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam. They were about eight days old when Halima Sadia collected Sayyidah Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wasallam from Sayyidah Amina radiallahu ta'ala anha. For two years, she raised the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam and she experienced amazing miracles. Firstly, she noticed that she was dry herself, unable to feed a child, but the arrival of the Prophet ﷺ allowed her to feed the Prophet ﷺ. Her mode of transport, the donkey, was lifeless, dead, it had no energy on the way to Mecca, but on the way back, it was completely rejuvenated and energized like a different animal. And people asked, oh Halima, have you got a new mode of transport? And she says, no, it's not the new transport, rather the one who is traveling upon it has given life to my donkey. And that was Sayyidina Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. They said, oh Halima, when did you become so prosperous and rich with your lantern burning all night, so much light coming from your home? She says, it's not my lantern, but the nur of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is enlightening my house. Likewise, the land of the Halima Sadia was barren. There's not much happening there. But the arrival of the Prophet وسلم, allowed the animals to be filled with milk. The land was filled with vegetation because of the Prophet وسلم, She is buried in Jannat al -Baqi. She was gifted 40 goats by the Prophet وسلم, And she, the Prophet وسلم, had a stepsister who once came into the company of the Prophet وسلم, and tears rolled down the face of the Prophet وسلم, when he remembered his youth and shared his times with Shaima, who was a few years older. And also Halima Sadia, after two years, when upon returning the Prophet وسلم, she said that Amina saw the sadness and sorrow on the face of Halima Sadia, who was then given a blessed opportunity to raise the Prophet وسلم, to the age of six. May Allah Ta'ala elevate the maqab of Sayyidah Halima As-Sadia.